Hey, I'm Dave, and this is the X Car. I myself, many years ago, bought my first X Car, and I couldn't be more stoked about it. I bought the first one, it was a couple years ago, the first. Ooh, sorry. I myself bought an X Car many years ago, the first iteration, in fact. And I am super stoked with it, been able to make a ton of really cool things. I bought it because of what it was known for in the community. It was easy to use, easy to set up, you can even customize it a little bit. The software package it comes with, also really easy to use. And then finally, the number of materials that you can 3D carve with it. Let's dive into the details of what an X-Carve is. The X-Carve is a 3D carver made for the workshop. For personal use at home, maybe it's for work, whatever the context is, you're able to cut things out of many different kinds of material. The, literally, the list is gigantic, the number of materials that you can use to cut with the carver. So to start, the x carve can handle wood no problem. It buzzes through it really quickly, really cleanly. There's even a bunch of drop-down menus that allow you to choose, is it hardwood, softwood, and then dials in the settings for your machine automatically. Next, you may want to dive into some plastics, like this two-tone plastic here. Again, plastics, really easy for the x carve to handle, and other settings that are automatically put in. It can also cut aluminums. That's actually the reason I got my first x carve It's because I knew it could cut aluminum. Now you have to go pretty slow and you gotta make sure you're being safe with this and not breaking bits and things. But after that learning curve, you're able to cut aluminum, which is super awesome. I actually bought it so I could make more 3D printers. Now one of the things that is my favorite that we've been able to do is take a 3D printed part and then do its finishing touches using the 3D carver. This is 3D printed polycarbonate, which is really tough to get great details in polycarbonate without a lot of practice. So we were able to 3D print this and then carve that polycarbonate using the 3D carver. We used a 1 8 bit and went pretty slow, but the finish turned out great. We've made it really easy to get started with the x carve. Your only choice is do you want the 500 millimeter one or the 1000 millimeter one? And that really is just based on how big of a project and how much space you have in your workshop. These kits are completely ready to go. Comes with a DeWalt router, which is used as the spindle. Comes with a starter pack of materials and even the bits you'll need to get started. Lastly, I wanna talk about Easel. That is the software made by Inventables and comes with your x carve Totally free to use and you cannot stress how easy it is. There's a bunch of apps in it that allow you to create your own projects. There are even projects that are saved and shared, so you can import those and modify them to your own needs. All said and done, Easel is just super easy to get started with. I absolutely love playing around with the X-Carve in my workshop. It's really inspiring. Seeing the projects that are done out there is also really cool. My next project might be a full-size guitar. I've seen somebody do it and I'm inspired. To go learn more or to get one now, go to matterhackers.com. Thank you for watching. If you liked that, subscribe to our channel to keep up to date with all of our videos. And remember, go to matterhackers.com to shop for everything 3D printing.